Welcome everyone. Given to us is a triangle with side length A, B and C. This video will prove that radius of this X circle touching the side length A is given by area of triangle, this yellow triangle divided by S minus A where S is semi perimeter. Let's check the solution. For that, let's join all the three vertex of this triangle ABC to the center. That's join AO, BO and CO. Area of this yellow triangle ABC, that is nothing but area of this pink triangle ABO plus area of this blue triangle COA. And from these two triangles, if you we'll subtract this green triangle, we'll be left with area of this yellow triangle. Now for triangle ABO, for this pink triangle, now area is given by half of base into height. Now if base is C centimeter, height is distance of this vertex from the baseline and this height is nothing but radius of circle. So area of this pink triangle is half of C times of RA. And same way area of this blue triangle now if we join OE, OE is the radius and radius is perpendicular to the tangent and for area of this blue triangle if we will consider B as the base then this RA will be the height so area will be half of B times of RA and area of this pink green triangle for that if we will consider A as the base then this perpendicular distance is what is height. So height is again the radius of this X circle. So area of green triangle which we have to subtract is half of A times of RA. Now in this let's take RA the radius of X circle as common. So we'll get area of triangle as C plus B minus A by 2. In the numerator let's add A and subtract A. So when we are adding A we'll get this as A plus B plus C subtracting a so this will become 2 times of a now a plus b plus c by 2 that is what is semi perimeter and 2 by 2 a by 2 that is a so we are getting it as r a times of s minus a now radius of this x circle that is nothing but area of triangle abc divided by s minus a and that's what we had to prove and hence prove I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata. Bye bye.